I really wish that I could, but we have the helmets on just for safety up here on the roof. It's protocol. There's a lot going on. Check out this. These people are getting ready to go really, really soon now. Does that just make your stomach drop or what? I don't know. I think it's pretty cool, but if you ask like a whole bunch of other people, you'll probably get some different answers, including from Tom Madeira over here who wants nothing to do with this. He says he likes his feet on the ground. Um, and I'm also here with Matt Glad. But first, can you just talk a little bit about what this is and why it's so important for the Special Olympics? So um, everything that we do throughout the year to raise money and to raise awareness is so important for us as Special Olympics. It allows our athletes to do so many things, social events throughout the year, and you know, just to get them um, out and participate like Matt's about to jump over the edge. I think at 11 o'clock today. So it's just a great feeling. And, and, you know, they're just great athletes and great people. And we just love doing events like this. Right. And this over here is super important. This is the training. This is That's exactly correct. what goes into it. Um, so can you just talk a little bit about what they're learning right now and kind of the process of getting down? It's 30 floors, right? That, uh, exactly. So right now, the uh, individuals that are in the blue shirts are the trainers. Um, everybody who, before they rappel off the building, go, goes through a training session. They learn how to fall backwards, use the speed cable, um, and use the ropes properly. And then they have the individuals up here who are also helping you, just in case you panic and <laughs> get stuck halfway uh, down the building. So everybody has to go through this protocol before they are allowed over the edge. And Matt, I know you've done this 11 times now, yes. right? I think today's going to be your 12th. What's yes. important for people to know about this? Is it scary? If people want to know about it, they can, like, um come up to me and I would tell them about it and then halfway down is someone's going to knock on the window and you can just smile and they, and we have people taking photos and we also have a now photographer my dad and he's taking photos and the photos that he take goes back to Debbie Horn and it goes on the SOCT website. Awesome. So you're not afraid of heights. This no. is nothing for you. No. <laughs> and um, I'm coming back next year, and uh, Fox 61 crew is coming back next year, and me and her are going to do it. Yeah, I'm coming back. What do you say? Next yeah. year, both of us at the same time yeah. going down the building. <laughs> well, we have and, more. And also, if anyone have any more information, they can see Tom Madeira or Jackie tour or www.sfct.org. Awesome, great. Well, this is such a great thing that's going on today, and it's so important to raise money for the Special Olympics, so we appreciate all that's being done in order to make this happen. Uh, so really cool support. stuff coming out here today. They're going down the building any minute now, so we're looking forward to seeing that. But Tim and Erica, back over to you.